What if I told you that one single spice could make a huge difference in your dog's health and lifespan? A spice that's probably sitting in your kitchen cupboard right now. It might sound crazy, but research shows it's true. In fact, there are over 6,000 studies showing the health benefits of this spice for both dogs and people. Before we get to that secret spice though, make sure you click subscribe and hit the little bell icon below so you don't miss any other helpful videos from this channel. Hi, I'm Vanessa from Dogs Naturally, and the spice I'm talking about is turmeric. And more specifically, a lot of turmeric's potent benefits comes from its active ingredient, curcumin. It may seem strange that a simple spice has so many benefits, but the research has shown turmeric can trump lots of more expensive drugs, including arthritis drugs, steroids, chemotherapy, inflammatory bowel disease drugs, and anti-inflammatory drugs. In this video, I want to share with you five specific reasons why turmeric and curcumin are so beneficial for dogs. Later on, I'll also discuss exactly how much turmeric to give your dog and which dogs shouldn't get turmeric, so make sure to watch till the end of the video. So the first benefit is that turmeric is anti-inflammatory. Many people think inflammation is only a problem for dogs with joint disease, but chronic hidden inflammation is a silent killer and the root of nearly all disease. Cancer, arthritis, allergies, kidney disease, dental disease, digestive disease are all caused by inflammation. And turmeric is one of the best supplements for natural inflammation support. A 2014 study found that the curcumin found in turmeric outperformed ibuprofen in people with arthritis. Another 2004 study found that curcumin not only worked just as well as anti-inflammatory drugs, but also worked even better than both aspirin and ibuprofen. So if you're looking for a natural anti-inflammatory, consider turmeric. The second key benefit of turmeric for dogs is that turmeric helps fight cancer. We know that chronic inflammation can lead to cancer. And we also know that turmeric is a powerful antioxidant, but how powerful? Well, a UK study showed that curcumin could stop precancerous changes from becoming cancer. So turmeric can help prevent cancer, and turmeric can also treat cancer naturally. Nearly one third of studies done on turmeric are cancer research, and the results are very promising. Turmeric has been shown to kill cancer cells and prevent more from growing. The American Cancer Society claims that curcumin interferes with cancer development, growth, and spread. Recently, curcumin has received a great deal of focus because of its ability to reduce tumor size and kill cancer cells. Half of adult dogs today will get cancer. So turmeric could be a great way to protect your dog from cancer and the inflammation that causes it. The next reason to consider giving your dog turmeric is for natural arthritis relief. Arthritis results from inflammation and as we saw earlier, turmeric can decrease inflammation in the body. But turmeric can also relieve the pain and stiffness in arthritis. And it can even do so better than conventional pain medications. In 2014, a group of researchers in Thailand published a study comparing curcumin versus ibuprofen treatment in patients with knee osteoarthritis. They found curcumin worked just as well as ibuprofen to reduce pain. And it did so without the gastrointestinal side effects that patients who took ibuprofen experienced. Speaking of which, that brings us to the next benefit, which is that turmeric can support gastrointestinal disorders. Turmeric's anti-inflammatory effects can be helpful in treating inflammatory bowel disease and other gastrointestinal disorders. It's been shown in several preclinical studies to have positive effects on gut inflammation and gut permeability. Researchers in Japan commented that curcumin's inhibitory effects on major inflammatory mechanisms and its unrivaled safety profile suggest it has bright prospects in the treatment of IBD. Finally, the fifth benefit of turmeric is that it may be able to replace steroids for your dog. Many dogs are on steroids for allergies and joint pain, but some studies show curcumin can be just as effective and have fewer side effects. Some authors noted, the lack of side effects with curcumin is its greatest advantage compared with corticosteroids. And this is perhaps the biggest benefit of turmeric. Not only can it work just as well as many drugs, but it also doesn't carry the same nasty, unwanted side effects. So now you know how great turmeric is, but how much is right for your dog? The recommended dose of turmeric for dogs 
is 15 milligrams to 20 milligrams per pound of body weight per day. Or more simply put, an eighth to a quarter teaspoon per day for every 10 pounds of body weight. This is a rough starting point, but you can increase the amount from there, up to about a tablespoon for larger dogs. However, you'll want to give turmeric in smaller amounts a few times a day because curcumin leaves the body quickly. Turmeric is also binding and can cause constipation, so add some water or kefir to your dog's meals along with the turmeric. Also, remember that turmeric's bright yellow color can stain your hands, countertops, and your dog, so handle it with a bit of care. Now, the last thing I want to leave you with is that even though turmeric works and is safe, this doesn't mean all dogs should get turmeric. Turmeric is a warming spice, so if your dog is always hot and seeking out cool floors to lie on, turmeric may not be the spice for him. Turmeric can also interact with some medications, such as anti-inflammatory and diabetes drugs, and may interfere with some chemotherapy treatments. So if your dog is on any medications, check with your holistic vet before adding turmeric to his diet. Turmeric is also harmful for patients with bile tract obstruction or gallstones. Chances are turmeric will only help, but it's always best to check first. If you have any questions about turmeric, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe and visit dogsnaturallymagazine.com for more information. Thanks for watching.